Okay, so here we got uh, ACES, model number is X541N. And this came in as uh, no power. Seems like the screws are out, so someone must have worked on this computer before. So what we're gonna do is, we could probably just pop this up because the screws are out. So I'm gonna open the case. All right. Yeah, definitely someone took this apart before. So first thing I'm gonna do is, okay, they did unplug stuff. So this board has been worked on before. That's what we know so far. And the power button, as you can see, is on the keyboard. It's right here. So the 3.3 volts for the power button should be somewhere on this. And that's what we're going to check for. So let's check and see if we're getting three volts anywhere on this keyboard here, connection. Three point two. Okay. So this is probably our power button. So we could try and short that to ground. I heard something coming on and the computer is coming on. Okay, and as you can see, the computer is coming on. So this must be a problem with the keyboard or the keyboard connection. It wasn't connected right. Other than that, the computer is coming on fine. Okay, so uh, keyboard is on. Moment of truth. We push the power button and I hear something and the computer is coming on. So this was just a connection problem. For now, I just need to format it, reinstall Windows, and the computer will be ready. Uh, that's it for now. I hope you liked the video, and I will see you in the next one.